Hit the dab, hit the eat, beat my me- Go to sleep. <laughs> you guys are the best. Treyarch's biggest mistake. Boy, does the COD community love a negative title. But don't worry, we're not going too negative today. You know, I'm not a boy to be head-ass negative just for the sake of views, boys. We're, we're realistic out here. We're on the peak of human evolution, and if you are too, make sure to subscribe, because we almost have an army of 200 million. We can almost march on the capital and take it over. You know you, you know how it goes, boys. Now, Black Ops 4. We already have DLC 1. We are almost three months into this game's life cycle, which means we are no longer in the honeymoon period. You know, we're not like, oh, this is great because it's the newest game. You know, we're past that stage, and I think we can happily say that this game has not World War II'd, if you catch my drift. It hasn't IW'd where it's dead on arrival, either. You know, Black Ops 4 is not dead, it's alive, it's breathing, I mean, it, it, may, it may have AIDS. Alright, it's infested. So what I mean by this is, I love this game. That's what I mean, we're not too negative, I love this game. And the thing is, I love all three modes, but multiplayer. Huge mistake. Um, there's something that really grinds. It really cheese grates the sack. Like, it's really, it's AIDS, man. And that's specialists. Now, on the topic of a specialist, Zero, who we hate, that hoe, that B ruined everything. She's actually getting a nerf on Tuesday. Wait, that's tomorrow? She's getting a nerf tomorrow? Thank Christ. Now, apart from the whole, uh, you know, the whole... Stuff about Black Ops 4's development and how it was all messy and Treyarch didn't know what they were doing and they kept backtracking and this and that. That's a huge mistake, but I truly think the biggest mistake was Specialists. Like, I am telling you right now, I love this game, I play multiplayer every single day. I'm already halfway through Fifth Prestige, and I sit there every single game, and boy, I'm telling you, Specialists are more annoying than anything that was broken in Modern Warfare 2, and don't even... I'm not even joking, boys. Like, you know, death streaks. In fact, specialists are glorified death streaks. You know, Modern Warfare 2 had one man army, noob tubes, danger close, terrible spawns, overpowered streaks. The Harrier should have been a 10, not a 7 kill streak. Like, you, you get me, boys. That game is AIDS. I love Modern Warfare 2, it's AIDS, but specialists are even worse. Like, you'll see it in the gameplay. I purposely chose the gameplay that I have for the background because of how much just like AIDS happens but that's the thing you don't have to go out of your way to get gameplay with AIDS specialists because it happens every single match and here's the thing I'm a pretty decent player I'm like a very mediocre player I'm not I, I have fingers I have thumbs I can play but I'm not I'm not Korean Savage or any of those guys you know Dismo Ali A <laughs> my boy Ali A is out here man but seriously it's like Jesus Christ I memed so hard I forgot what I was saying uh, yeah, I'm a pretty decent COD player, but I feel like specialists punish me when I do nothing wrong. And that's just terrible. You know, you could say, oh, because you're a good player, you can use specialists well. Okay, yeah. Say I, I get a, a quad feed with a war machine. That doesn't mean that the nine bang, the shield, the dog, the mines, the, the everything is... That doesn't make them less ass. From the leaks that happened almost a year ago where they were saying Black Ops 4 is going to be more about specialists. In fact, specialists are going to be a bigger deal. I was like, I hope this isn't true. We got the multiplayer trailer and multiplayer was not what I expected for Black Ops 4. But, like, man, I just kind of don't see why Treyarch brought back this system, let alone made it, made specialists even an even bigger deal. And that's the thing, I know some people are saying, like, oh, we should get a bare bones playlist, a no specialist playlist. But guys, that's not going to happen because the entire multiplayer is built around this hero shooter idea of specialists. And if they did that bare bones mode, that would be Treyarch admitting defeat that what they did is not what the community wanted. That That's not going to happen. But the only reason why I can see Treyarch put them in this game is to appease the, the bottom of the barrel people like I can get killed by a roadkill skunk who is who has got his uh his guard dog and it kills me three times in a minute like yeah it's really good game and I do think there that's it out of anything in this entire game adding specialists to multiplayer was Treyarch's biggest mistake if it was just like Black Ops 2 where it's just no insta kill wonder weapons no 
insta-kill or overpowered abilities, and if it was just generic soldiers from different factions, like in Black Ops 2, this game would be Black Ops 2 too, and it would be... It would just be so much crispier, juicier, spicier, zestier. It would be... It would definitely be at the, the, the top tier, 100%. So, Treyarch, you know, if you could, like, delete specialists from history, the history books, that'd be pretty neat. Thanks from the COD community. So, guys, there you go. That's a kind of a rant I needed to get off my chest after being killed by all that, all that cheese for months on end. Boys, stay spicy, and I'll see you in the next one.